If you want to boost your FPS from this to this, in this video, I'm going to unveil the secret block strap fast flags that can instantly boost your FPS, lower your ping, and fix annoying lag and stutters. Stick around, your smoothest Roblox experience starts right now. Gear Up Booster is one of the best program for optimization of your ping while you're playing Roblox, using a wired or wireless connection. Get this paid program for free from my description and enjoy your game with lower ping. Step 1. Make your CPU. Use all cores for better gaming for Roblox. To make sure your CPU is using all of its power, press the Windows key and type system configuration in the search bar. Click on it to open it. In the window that shows up, click the Boot tab at the top. Then click on the Advanced Options button. Now check the small box next to where it says Number of Processors. Then click the drop-down menu below it and pick the biggest number you see there. This setting tells Windows to use all the cores in your CPU, which helps your computer run faster, respond quicker, and makes games like Roblox work smoother. Once you choose the highest number, click OK. Then click Apply and close the window. Step 2. Use registry tweaks to make your PC run better for Roblox. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. To make your PC work even better, you can use something called registry tweaks. These are small changes inside Windows that help your CPU and GPU do their jobs better. These tweaks help reduce lag speed up game loading and stop the FPS drops while playing Roblox. It does not matter if your PC has an Intel AMD or NVIDIA GPU, these tweaks will still help Roblox work better and feel smoother. Making these small changes will improve your gaming and also help your system become more stable when you're playing. Step 3. Make Roblox run smoother. Using Block Strap. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. Now in this step, go to the FPS Boost Pack and download the Blockstrap Launcher file. After the file finishes downloading, install the launcher on your PC. Once it's installed, open the Windows search bar type Blockstrap and open the app. Inside the Blockstrap app, click on Configure Settings, then go to the part called Engine Fast Flag Settings. Scroll down until you find the Fast Flag section. Click the button that says I know what I'm doing and then click Add new to start adding your custom settings. Next, open the text file that came with the boost pack. This file has different graphics setting options. The best one for most people is low-end graphics unless your PC is extremely weak. Using this setting will help you get more FPS, less lag, and better Roblox performance overall. For this guide, I'm using low-end graphics, and I think you should also use it for the best experience in Roblox. Copy the text from the file and paste it inside the Fast Flags section in Block Strap. Then click OK to apply the new settings. If a message shows up asking for confirmation, click Yes to continue. After that, close Blockstrap and start any Roblox game to enjoy smoother, faster, and better gameplay. Step 4. Use Quick CPU to make your CPU work at full power for Roblox. First, download and install a program called Quick CPU. Once it's installed, it will open and show the main screen. You can get all the files I use in the pack for my official website. I've provided the link in the description. In this guide, I'll show you how to set up Quick CPU to get better performance in games, more FPS, and less input delay. At the top of the app, look for a drop-down menu and choose Ultimate Performance. This makes sure your CPU always runs at full speed. This will make your game smoother, give more FPS, and reduce delay when pressing buttons. Now scroll down and find Core Parking. Set it to 100% so that all your CPU cores are always turned on. Next set. Performance to 100% frequency, scaling to 100%, and turbo boost to 100%. These changes make sure your CPU is running at full speed all the time, which helps with gaming. After setting all of these to 100%, click Apply and then click OK. Now click the button that says Advanced CPU Settings. A new window will open. In this new window, check the box to turn on Turbo Boost. This lets the CPU run faster when needed. Also check the box for Enhanced Speed Step Technology, EIST. This helps save power but still keeps high performance. After turning on both of these settings, close the window and exit Quick CPU. All your changes will be saved automatically. In this step, I'm going to show you the best tool to get stable ping for Roblox. So first, download the Gear Up Booster tool from the official website using the link in the description. After downloading, install it on your PC. Once installed, you'll see the Gear Up Booster interface. The first thing you'll need to do is log in with your Facebook or Google account. On the Home tab, you'll find all the games installed on your PC. If you go to the Games tab, you can browse thousands of games available for optimization. To optimize your network and FPS, return to the Home tab and select the game you want to boost. For example, I'll select Roblox. Click the Boost button and the tool will begin optimizing the game. It will automatically find the best server for you. 
Next, you'll need to choose your server region. Select the nearest server for the best connection. In my case, the Middle East server works best. After selecting the server, close the window. Now go to the End tab where you'll see a list of servers available in the Middle East. Choose the nearest one, or let GearUp automatically pick the best server for you. I recommend setting it to automatic for the best results. Finally, close the window and launch your game using GearUp Booster. This will help you optimize Roblox or any other game for lower ping and higher FPS. Step 5. Make your GPU run better. Using MSI Utility for Roblox. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. In this step, we'll make your graphics card GPU work better with your PC. This will help reduce input lag and give you higher FPS in Roblox. When the tool opens, you'll see a list of hardware parts in your computer. Look for your GPU. It could be NVIDIA AMD or Intel. When you find it, check the box next to MSI and set interrupt priority to high. If you are using built-in graphics like Intel HD graphics or an AMD APU, do the same steps for that too. Once you're done making changes, click Apply and then close the app. These settings help your graphics card respond faster, which gives better FPS and less lag in Roblox. Step 6. Make your keyboard faster. Using filter keys. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. Now I'll show you how to make your keyboard respond quicker by using a tool called Filter Keys Setter. First, open the program. You will see a few settings you can change. Set Ignore under to 0 ms repeat delay to 130 ms and repeat rate to 10 ms. After putting in these numbers, check the small box on the right to turn the settings on. Then click OK to save everything. These changes will help your keyboard react faster when typing or playing games, and it will reduce input lag. Step 7. Turn off startup apps to make Windows boot faster for Roblox. In the last step, you will turn off programs that start automatically when your computer turns on. This helps your PC start faster and gives it more power to run games like Roblox better. Press Ctrl plus Shift plus plus ESC to open the Task Manager. Then click on the Startup tab. Here you'll see a list of programs that launch when Windows starts. Right-click the ones you don't need and choose Disable. Doing this will reduce the number of programs running in the background, make your computer start faster and help it run smoother. Turning off startup apps is one of the easiest ways to make your PC work better. If this guide helped you, please remember to like, share, and subscribe for more videos about gaming and PC optimization. I'll see you in the next one.